Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this is Ryan with Cognitive Investigative Services. Today we are doing a story on an investigation we have run on the Department of Homeland Security and a specific incident for which they have uh, severely abused remote neural monitoring and several targeted victims. In this case, a DHS employee utilized the RNM as the equivalent of a dating app for which he found interest in a specific female and he went to great stakes to not only break up the relationship between the two that were basically planning to get married, but then also used it to manipulate her, learn all about her background, everything from what she liked to disliked, to even sabotaging her significant other, causing him great bodily um, harm and irreparable damages. Now, the employer was actually fired, but this didn't necessarily come to light. They didn't, DHS didn't reach out to the actual victim themselves or the victim's boyfriend. In this case, it's a problem because the damages caused to both um, shed significant light on the lack of accountability that our US government is taking in these stances. We also are aware in this specific case that uh, the DHS employee, Brian, who was actually fired, uh, or Ryan, uh, in this case, had done this several times before. So essentially he was creating uh, the equivalent of his own harem by manipulating, modifying, and changing the behavior of other US citizens to fit his perverse sexual desires. That is correct. Now, if this has happened once, we're aware that it's probably happened significantly more over the course of time and throughout different agencies. So again, we present this in investigation um, and we are doing other inquiries and have filed several complaints with DHS. We will let you know how that turns out. But ultimately speaking, this is a disgraceful use of the equivalent of a voice of God weapon or MK technologies, which were designed to modify the actions and behavior of any targeted victim. Now to use it, especially to break up relationships or let's say create a new relationship when you're the nefarious party in control of the other is very uh, Dr. Frankenstein-ish in the sense that you're essentially creating, uh, playing God, and then obviously manipulating um, and conditioning and grooming, you know, other females. So this man is definitely a predator and should be prosecuted, arrested, uh, and put away for a long time. Again, this is Ryan from CIS. Check us out. We have more on the specific investigation and uh, we'll update it as they come. Thank you so much.